prayer maybe teaching on prophetic tonight doing some prophetic training trying to as it, my shirt says come out of the cave calling the prophets in Atlanta out of the cave tonight so and then we're gonna do some intercession you never know what's gonna happen on our infamous ride to the airport we are on our way Focus, 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 focus. <laughs> there, you gotta decree a thing and it shall be established. We're here in Atlanta. There's a lot of emotional support animals. Have you noticed how many emotional support? I mean, I walk down the aisle, there's like a kangaroo, a squirrel, a dog. What is this? Are all these people this emotionally unstable? And if so, should I really be on the plane with them? This is my thought as we enter Atlanta. Listen, we're going for it. Say hello. Hola. desire spiritual gifts especially that you may prophesy it's the Greek word zeal and it's a very very powerful word it, it, it's a word of passion it's a word of fervor it means to burn with zeal how many of you ever wanted something so bad you burn with zeal for it we burn with zeal over football games all the time oh I thank you Lord and then I got a divine inspiration I had seen it happen it never happened to me before but I had seen some certain people getting slain in the spirit so I just said this is my way out I took a couple of people Well, that was really fruitful. This Awakening House Prayer in Atlanta is growing. You know what the key is to anything in your life is to be consistent. You want to see fruit from something, you've got to be consistent. We've been coming here now at this point for six months and we're really seeing this breaking, breaking open. People want to start doing it every other week instead of just once a month. They want us here on a full-time basis. This comes from sowing. You always reap when you sow. So whatever it is in your life that you want to see fruit in, be consistent. Pull the weeds. Keep watering a thing. In other words, just keep your hand to the plow. Don't look back. Don't stop. When it gets hard, when the resistance comes, push past it. You can do this. There are things in your life God wants to blow up in this season in a good way. Maybe some things He wants to blow out of your life as well. You can do this. You can see fruit that remains. Stay steady. Amen. God bless you.